XRP is now the number two cryptocurrency in the world. It is just taken over Ethereum. Welcome back, guys. It's CryptoRocco here, and in today's video, it's my pleasure to do an analysis of XRP. So I'll talk about why the main reason for this pump, why the crypto XRP has gone up, and I'll also do a technical analysis at the end of this video. So stay tuned, guys, and I'm really happy to bring this video for you. If you are an XRP fan, I'm sure you your bank account bank account has increased, and you're really happy about it. And I'm sure your friends the friends the haters on YouTube and Facebook that people that people have been saying XRP is not good it's dead don't buy XRP they'll be apologizing to you because the key thing in investment is guys you can't follow the herd uh, about something like 90% 95% of people lose money in investing and, and it's probably worse when they're trading so we have to be different and XRP has led this market which is very strange to see so usually guys when there is when there is a price increase bitcoin goes up and then uh, altcoins follow in this in this instance guys xrp has led the market xrp broke out and then Bitcoin, I mean Bitcoin hasn't even broken up but then Bitcoin went up slightly so XRP is leading the market and, and these numbers that you're seeing these numbers are not of this year these numbers are from last year we never we've not seen this kind of number this year 62 percent this is a crazy crazy number guys so if you are an XRP fan, I'm sure you're happy about it. And some of the friends and our haters of XRP, they're, they're probably apologizing to you. I mean, if you've been following me, I'm, I've been covering XRP a lot, but I'm, I'm not, I wasn't fully convinced by XRP. And slowly, slowly, I'm, I'm investing a lot more in XRP. And um, again, I've still got my concerns, but again, I'm, I'm, being, I'm a bit of a convert on XRP as well. I'm just being honest, guys. So the main reason why this market pumped was that Ripple hints at cryptocurrency product will go live in the next month or so so that was the main reason i covered it in my previous video guys and if you I mean two days ago if you bought xrp when i when i made this video you would be up some good good dollars guys good good money so it talks about X Rapids and X Rapids is a product that actually uses XRP. It's real world adoption. So they, they can't be, I mean, even if you don't like Ripple and XRP, you still should be happy with, with this because it is driving cryptocurrency adoption. So I'm really, really for the, what's going on with, with XRP and Ripple. The concern that people say is Ripple owns about 60 billion of the 100 billion XRP tokens in circulation. But there are, I mean, I'm not going to go into the detail, but there are, uh, ways that that stops us. Ripple can't just sell all this, uh, all, all the XRP at once, and and there's things that stop it. So I've, I've talked about them in my previous video, but this video is is about the price analysis. So let's have a look, guys. What happened? So Ripple XRP broke out about I'd say three was it three days ago? It started breaking out, and um, so it, yeah, it was on the 18th when it, it kind of had this pump, and then after that, few people were saying, "Oh, it's just a pump. Let's sell. Let's let's get out of it." And and I'll be honest, I I I sold some there, and then I bought some round round there. So. And the main the main reason for this, what people do not understand is, as we're in a bear market, whenever we have a small increase, we take profit and it goes down. But this bull, this bull candle, this very very bullish candle, is kind of. It, it's a trend reversal like you'll be thinking that we are in an upward market and again I, I think it still needs to get above um I, i'd say it still needs to break above this 50 percent of this level if it goes if it, if it falls like this and then goes above i'll be more bullish on it but again if you are in xrp you, you might want to take some profit because it's gone up so much but it is in a very very good position and and another thing is you, you these sort of price increase we've not seen it this year since since last year the last time we've seen a candle bigger than this was probably this one in December and we've gone up um, it, this is a, a ripple Bitcoin by the way we've gone up about 60% within within a week this is crazy guys and, and if it can form a higher low and it get above this level I'll be even even more bullish guys so let's have a quick look in my previous video guys i said that the this we need to hold this level the couple of days ago i said we need to hold this level and it broke above it and it kept going up kept going up and and since then it's, it has been going up and some of the levels i was looking at it broke through all the moving averages and one of the key levels i was looking at was was this and it did store around there in my previous video i said uh, 50 50 cents is a, is a key level and uh, i wasn't sure if it was going to break i thought it would it would pull back a, a lot lower and then move up it will take its time but it's not taking its time and i'll be honest guys uh, the last pump i've actually sold 
um some of it here and and, and i'm not actually in a big xrp position because i've taken some profits so i've missed out on this so if people have been hodling have made more money uh, than me trading it but I do think there will be a pullback guys when markets get stretched so much there's usually a pullback but if we can stay above um, let's have a look what uh, what level to target if we can stay above let's say 70 again I, I could bring Fibonacci levels and give you an exact target but if we can set a stay above kind of the 50% level of, of this big green candle as, as a ballpark figure then I'll say we're still bullish if we can stay above let's say the 60 cents mark and um, if we can pull back and and, and then form a higher low and from a higher high then i'll be even more bullish i'll get in my position but i do think there will be a pullback but that's this is not financial advice guys this is just a trading tip if you are massively on xrp you can keep dollar cost averaging it and if you believe in the long term uh, ripple and xrp vision then you can keep a uh, dollar cost averaging i'm giving you a trader's technical analysis perspective so i've given you two perspectives if you're a trader you might want to take some profit if you are a hodler you see it long term you might want to dollar cost average and, and stick to your profits again this is not financial advice guys do not sell your houses and buy xrp do your own research and invest knowledgeably use your own research and your own logical thinking to make those decisions so thank you very much for watching this video guys long may this xrp bull run continue although i said the short term it might see a little bit of a pullback because market never go up and up and up as you know so there might be a little pullback but again xrp is going crazy i didn't think it would go this much up and and i'll, I'll be honest it kind of took me by surprise because uh, like i've said i've taken some profits already and then it just kept going up and up so we'll have to see how this plays out hopefully it keeps going up but again it might have a pullback and um, are we out of a full bear market of all of cryptocurrency i wouldn't say so because there might be another pullback guys we'll have to see bitcoin needs to get above its, its previous break of up its previous highs and if it can do that then i'll say that we are extremely bullish but it's great to see R ripple xrp sorry xrp leading the market and there might be some changes people have been saying xrp when x rapids get gets adopted xrp will take over bitcoin i'm not sure about it i'm not convinced yet but i'm definitely interested and i will be keeping an hour an eye out for xrp and your friends who've been hating on you saying xrp is a, sh is a rubbish coin uh, go go speak to them ask them about the 60 percent we'll see what they say and you have to be unique you have to take risks and people that have risked on xrp are reaping the benefits of xrp and this they might have never get another chance to buy xrp at this cheap level if, if we are if we get out of this bear market i'm not saying i will because we could you know bitcoin could go go down to four thousand five thousand there are some um fud around us but still if if we do not if we carry on this then we might never be able to buy xrp in this process again this is just my thoughts guys do your own research and dollar cost average do not spend all your money on xrp do your own research first before investing so thank you very much for watching this video guys if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel and um, um I've, another great thing for me is i've just reached 2000 subscribers in a very short amount of time so honestly guys from the bottom of my heart thank you very much and subscribe to my channel because i will be doing a hundred dollars worth of xrp giveaway so subscribe to my channel to find out more about that and leave your xrp addresses below to win hundred dollars worth of xrp so thank you very much for watching this video guys i hope you've enjoyed it if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends and family and even if it's not my video talk to your friends and family about um xrp and cryptocurrency because as early adopters we need to be spreading the word so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much